What's up guys, this is Curtis with Place Productions and uh, just thought I'd bring you guys another moon video since we, we got such a great response from the last one. Um, tonight is um, also a big deal, probably a bigger deal than last time. Uh, we're looking at a lunar eclipse and it's about 75% over uh, right now with the shadow and really it's just looking like a crescent moon but if I open up the iris a little bit oh, that's closing it if I open up the iris a little bit you'll see the other side of the moon start to show up in the image and you'll notice it uh, has that bright red color to it to let you know that it is an eclipse and you can also see kind of blue ring on the um, outside of the shadow there and what makes tonight's eclipse particularly unique is because it's occurring on the solstice it's officially the first day of winter and it's um, 41 degrees where I'm at right now and I'm outside in a t-shirt and my house shoes Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close the iris back down. Focus is starting to act a little funny here. So as I was saying, um, the next time you're able to see a lunar eclipse on the night of a solstice will be um, about 80 years from now. And the most recent time... Um, don't mind the focus let me go ahead and adjust that manually and the uh, last time we saw something like this was over 350 years ago so this is the full lunar eclipse um, I'll probably come back in a few minutes once the shadow is completely over the moon and uh, show you guys what that looks like but uh, yeah it's been over 350 years since we've seen something like this, so pretty exciting. Uh, see you guys in a few minutes. Alright guys, it's now about 2.54 a.m. And, uh... Still 42 degrees, but I am so glad that I stayed up because as you guys can see, um, we're just getting some beautiful red and yellows and uh, light blues um, off of the moon right now. Um, I have my shutter turned all the way down to a third of a second, so it would be absolutely impossible to capture this without a tripod. Um, I even have my gain set to 6 dB, but uh, yeah, this is what it's about. Um, we haven't seen this in over 300 years, so uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm um, going to get inside and warm up. This is Curtis with Place Productions, and thanks for watching.